Welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into one of the most asked questions about GIMP. How do you actually ask for your work once you're done editing? Hi, once you've finished editing in GIMP and you're ready to get your image out, go up to the top menu and click File. Choose Export as or press Shift plus Command plus E. The export settings will be started from scratch. If you've already exported this image and just want to reuse your last settings, press Command plus E or click Export. This will overwrite the previous file automatically. If it's the first time you're exporting this image, you can use either Export as or Export. Both will start from scratch. Then the dialog box will appear. First up, you've got the Folders section on the left. Here you can select the folder to which your image will be exported. And in Field at the top is the File Name field. You can set your image name. Down in the bottom left corner of the export dialog, click select file type. Then move over to the bottom right, hover over that little slider. Click it and hold and drag to scroll through all the available formats. When you find the format you need, just click it. Or scroll down using your mouse and click on any file format you want. After selecting your file format, click the export button. Next, another dialog box will pop up where you can tweak image quality and metadata. At the top of that window, you'll see automatic. You can change it if you need a specific bit integer, or leave it on automatic to match your original image bit integer. From here, you can adjust the image quality. From these options, you can enable any metadata you want included in your image. Finally, click export to begin exporting your image. After the export finishes, the dialog box will close. Just navigate to the folder you chose, and you'll find your exported image. And that's it. You successfully exported your image from GIMP. If you found this tutorial helpful, tap that like button, subscribe for more GIMP tips, and drop a comment if you have any questions. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.